Hello, my name is Rich Dykoff. I live in Hasbrook Heights, New Jersey, and this is my family. My girlfriend, Melanie, who is a makeup artist, and my son, Jameson, who is one year old. So I've been wanting to do this for a long time, but then the baby came along and I didn't want this to look like we were only doing this because of the baby. So it's time. I just want her to know that this is about her. It's time for me to ask my girlfriend to marry me. So today I'm going to New York City to the M Jewelers owned by good friends of mine, Mark and Anthony, to pick out a ring. How's it going? Doing great, how about you? Excited? Oh yeah. All right, let's make it happen. Let's do this. What kind of style are you looking for, shape? Uh, looking to do a round halo. Okay, let's do it. Um, what about something like this? Yes, that's absolutely what I'm talking about. So this is the one? This is the one, man. Let's do it, guys. Ready? <laughs> Now that the ring's finished, I'm going to meet up with Mel's parents to ask her for her hand. I hope this goes all right. Better. Hey, what's going on? Hey, how you, how you doing? doing? Good, how are you? Good, good. How, how you doing? doing? How are you, man? Traffic's killing me. Yeah, yeah tell me about, about it. it. Cheers. To you. What's going on? What's the occasion here? As you guys know, I, uh, Mel and I have been dating for going on seven years. So even though we haven't done things, maybe uh, a little backwards. In order? <laughs> yeah, a little in order. <laughs> yeah. I thought maybe that we could do the proper thing. And I wanted to ask both of you for her hand in marriage. Uh, in marriage. <laughs> well, I mean, you've been, like you said, together for seven years now. You have a beautiful baby. I'm happy that you're starting your own place and your own family and everything. As sad as I am to have you guys leave, I'm happy that you're starting life. So you had a baby and now you want to have her hand in marriage. Just as long as you take care of her, because she is our, our little baby. And we love her dearly. <laughs> Don't <laughs> gonna make me cry. Then I give you my blessing and just take good care of her because she's you know, precious. I, I know you will. She's very precious to both of us. She's my mom. Okay. <laughs> so uh, you've been uh, you've been like part of the family. You've been like the son I haven't had for the last you know five six years since. We got to know each other a lot, and uh, now we spend the holidays together. And now you're living in the house, and you're the father of my grandson. So it only makes a lot of sense that you become my son-in-law. So I, I would be honored for you to join the family. Um, as Elaine said, it's it's a commitment, and it's our only daughter. And the most important thing in the world to me is is Melanie and Melanie's health, happiness. So. Make sure that you don't do anything stupid. If you think dating, I mean, dating and your relationship is tough, marriage is ten times tough. Stick not it that, out. Not that we're the uh, uh, model no, marriage I counselors. Knew you were that. No, 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 no. But I'm saying, don't jump the gun ever because it's it's a marriage is a sacred thing and it's two people and it's, it's tough. Yeah. So as long as you stick it out and stay together and please don't have any more babies to take it married. <laughs> Do the right thing and I'll support you on everything you need except well I mean I won't support you but <laughs> Are you sure about that? I'll second that. I'll support you for you <laughs> when you need it. <laughs> Do you have the ring yet? You guys want to see it? Oh Whoa. my god. It's got a light in there? Yeah. Oh my god. That's it's like going to be bigger than her finger. <laughs> oh, it's beautiful. Don't try it. Oh, it's beautiful. Don't set it. It's really beautiful. 
Oh my goodness. Well, that certainly wow. lives up to no yeah. needs. <laughs> and, and it was a lot bigger than the one I gave away. <laughs> Here it is. It's a little dirty though. <laughs> oh, that's beautiful. So the plan here was to hire Mel to do makeup on a known artist. That way she thinks it's a normal day's work and then I would come out of the back room and surprise, if I could pull this off, I'd be amazed. Yeah, give me five. Yeah. That's why I'm going to marry you today. Yes! Yes! Today, I'm going to propose to my girlfriend. For the proposal location, my buddy Brian Churlo, who is an amazing Grammy award-winning engineer, ended up hooking us up with the studio in New York where we rented a room for all of this to go down. There's nothing going on in this little vocal booth over here. So I can text you so I work in the film industry and I have some great friends who were offering to help me pull off how this proposal would go down. This chair's here, right? So he's sitting here. My good friends She's Jarrett and Jesse are operating the, the cameras following my experience way, through this. Which is good to signal. I mean, you should have her back to it though. Look, she look, should be looking it, like this. Give look it this like way. a, so don't do like a, like give it so she hears the door. So the plan here is to hire Mel to do makeup on an artist. And for that artist, we got Alexander De Leon, who is an amazing singer songwriter. My man, I just wanted to thank you again so much for this. It's an honor to be a part of it. Thank, Thank you, you so for much. thinking of me on a, on a big day. Dude. The biggest day. <laughs> the biggest day. This is going to be crazy. You bring the director's chair, then you'll be doing makeup in here. The idea is going to be like, I'm going to shoot you here, but okay. when we do makeup, you're going to be here. We'll never actually get to that. She's fully aware that there are going to be cameras there capturing the behind the scenes footage, so she would just think nothing of it. All right, so you'll be makeup here. I'm just going to shoot a couple things. It's only going to literally be like three minutes of you in the chair, and then he's going to come in. Yeah. We just want her to get settled and have her start. Yeah, she's just gonna know. awesome. The B camera will be with me, okay. so he'll be rolling in with me as soon as, I guess, text me with a cue or whatever. Or bid yeah. Once you get into the chair, I'm yeah. gonna shoot him a text, and I'm base. I'm gonna kind of cover up from over here. I mean, it doesn't really matter for you, but I'll probably be over here, and then they're walking through that way. So then you're just stuck in the fucking chair. <laughs> <laughs> About to park right near the corner of House and Broadway. If you could send someone, that would be awesome. I'll start to walk with everything. Okay. Game on. Guess we're doing it now. Where's the ring? So I'm in another room right now, kind of freaking out, going over what I want to say to Mel. Meanwhile, she's in the next room thinking that she's just at work and has no idea any of this is about to go down. I had a speech written out months and months in advance, and I studied this thing over and over and over again, and I knew I was just gonna nail it. Let's do this. <sighs> like, religiously since like Temple Run. Like when Temple Run came one. out, it was it was pretty nonstop for me for a yeah, while. That was a good one. My boyfriend always plays this like Star Wars game. He's obsessed with Star Wars. Yeah. And then I enter the room and And he like loves it. He's always on it. I'm like, it is. I would love to play that. It's a commander or something. I don't know. Hey there beautiful. Hi! Oh my hey. god! I was just talking about you. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> No idea what I said after that. What are you doing? So, none of this is real. But, I want to tell you what is. Stop it. From the day I first met you, you completely oh my changed my entire life. I'm so thankful to have you and our beautiful son, Jameson. And I can't even describe the feelings that I get every day waking up next to you. You are my dream girl. And you've completed just about everything in life that I've ever dreamt of. I love you with all my heart. And I want you to know that you are the most important person in this world to me. My name is Simulika. You are my best friend. You are the love of my life. Oh my god. Will you marry me? <laughs> yes. Yes. Oh my god, this is real life right now. I can't believe that I just pulled that part off. Oh my god, oh my god. Let's put this on you. <laughs> oh my god, I'm shaking. You're oh. shaking. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god, I love you. 
Oh my god! I'm sorry that this wasn't real. Oh my god! <laughs> He's real. Yeah, real. <laughs> it was just really funny because like we were just talking about you and I'm like, oh my god, we were talking about like your Star Wars game and all that. Oh my god, I'm shaking. Oh my god. <laughs> she really was shaking. Oh my god. Was absolutely amazing. Oh my god. Like, it could not have been better. So after the proposal, I already had set up reservations at one of our favorite places in the city, and I coordinated with a bunch of friends and family to already be there, waiting to surprise her. I just hope she doesn't have a heart attack after all this. I can't believe this worked. I can't believe that she never found it. And I honestly, I, I cannot believe that I pulled this off.